Hello YouTube. Hello. Welcome back to another uh, me and my face. Just open a can of uh, Strongbow Cider, Dark Fruit Edition. So, Play Expo yesterday. What a day. What a day. Fantastic day. Quite a busy week, in fact. Um, went round to Darren's house, Darren uh, Deloro, uh, last week. Uh, bought something off him. Now they nosy around his games room, which was very nice of him. And that was until Wednesday night. Uh, I think I made, did I make, make, did I make a video last week? I can't remember. And then yesterday was uh, play. Went with my good friend Paul Ellis. On the back wheel .com. I mean, sorry, on the back wheel UK. We're a running joke between me and uh, me and Ellis, me and Paul. So thoughts and feelings and pickups. I've only got a small selection of pickups, um, mainly mainly uh, compromising of gifts from a uh, fellow tuber. But we'll get onto that. So yeah, got there about half ten. Uh, packed, queuing like a snake all the way around the building. Uh, Daz did ring me up when we were in the queue, uh, told me to come over to him. But just as I come off the phone, the queue started moving, so I thought I didn't want to test me a look just in case he, you know, he'd already gone in and I couldn't get in queue. Because I'm polite like that, I'm uh, not one to push into queues and stuff. So, but yeah, we got inside and it was just a massive place. Like I said before, I've never been to one before, so I didn't really know what to expect. Um, you know, stalls, there's loads of stuff, games, obviously, it's a retro gaming event. Um, but the amount of consoles that were set up and old school computers, were, they were brilliant, fantastic. The arcade section, I think that was the, uh, the highlight. Um, spent a lot of time around the Astro City Cabs. Uh, quite a few shooters on there, there about three or four shooters on there. Um, and I met up with Matt uh, from Matt from Soulpunk Retro, the guy who does the pixel artwork, and a very nice chap. It took a bit of time tracking him down because the place is that big. I had my phone on loud but I couldn't hear text messages. But anyway, we met up with Matt and his friend Andy, and he brought a gift along for me. I'll just show you. That's some more pixel artwork. And you've probably seen it today on his video. But it is Sonic 2 Supersonic Transformation. Which I think is absolutely fantastic. I'll try and get a frame for that. Hopefully I can, so I'll just put that down. Save a bit of time rolling it up. So big thanks for that, Matt. Fantastic. Uh, it's gonna look really good on the wall. Frank, Frank's here with me, just having a sniff. Right, okay. So, oh, mind you, going back to Matt again. He did some trades, stroke gifts, more gifts on his behalf, uh, and I gave him some PSP games. So the first one I got from Matt was Green Dog. Now I had this back in the day, and at the time I thought it was really hard, but I played it today, and I've got quite far on it just with one live so yeah really good game really enjoying that getting back in stuck, stuck back into that the green dog theme park um, never really played theme park but well I've actually played Jurassic Park is Operation Genesis on the Xbox and I really like that and you know I like building stuff yeah, nice hands-on game so yeah looking forward to that so cheers Matt uh, nuclear Strike. I imagine this is carrying on from Desert Strike and Urban Strike on the Mega Drive. Nuclear Strike on the PS1. Colin McRae Rally, which is playing to the left of me. Uh, I like my rally games. Uh, big fan of the rally back in the day, so Colin McRae. So that's what I got from Matt. Now, pickup wise, oh, just before I uh, carry on, they also included a I don't know if you knew you had this in the box, no, I think it was in Green Dog's box. But I've got a very nice condition. Genesis Sonic the Hedgehog 2 poster. So that's gonna look brilliant on my wall. I have actually got Sonic 1 
Mega Drive post. I think it's my mum and dad's. I keep meaning to bring it over. We'll get that on the wall. Right, so, have a drink. Uh, pickups. Predator 2. Now I'm a big fan of Predator and uh, the Aliens franchise. I got this from Console Passion late on in the day. £6. Really nice condition. It were all sealed in one of those little uh, clear bag bags. Got the uh, see the manual cartridge. Cartridge is really nice, really nice and clean. Been playing this a bit this today and it's uh, yeah it's quite hard but nice game. I got a Sonic t-shirt because obviously everything Sonic related is me and then finally I pay £20 for a loose but very nice condition Super Mario Kart on the SNES and I've been after this for my SNES for a bit now uh, excuse me they had a, a few actually what they were like I mean quite a few of them were £20 but the amount of yellowing on the back and all the sticker were ripped and stuff like that. It was really, you know, really crap. So, yeah, I picked that up from Retro Plushy Games. So, yeah, works fine. I wore after some Japanese Sega Saturn shooters. But, unfortunately, I didn't see any. It must have been snapped up. Early doors. Uh, probably about does. But I think, it's, I think you've got to rip it, haven't you? Um, what else? What else? Yeah, went back to Daz, didn't really see him. Saw him very briefly outside by that time. I'd had a few of those uh, uh, red stripes at the bar. Me and Paul had been stood with uh, Stuart, Stu, to the UK. We stood there with him for about an hour and a half, chatting about uh, boot sales. Nice to meet Stu. Uh, I mean, obviously, you know, I've seen your face before, but it's, it's, um, it's, it's, it's a different experience in there, but it's all, it's all good. Don't worry, I'm not trying to say. I'm not trying to get at anything else there. But yeah, really nice fella. Very, uh, oh, he, thanks for showing him. Am I boring you, Frank? So, uh, yeah, very nice fella. Uh, I also saw Steve, Gashead Steve. Kind of jumped out on Steve after about two cans. Um, you alright, Steve? I don't know if you recognise me or what. But uh, yeah, that was me being a bit tipsy. Uh, Novabug, spoke to Novabug. A few other guys. So Jay and Shock16 Adam outside the Daz. But at that time, I think I was about four cans by then, so a little bit, um, not worse for wear, like, but um, yeah, trying to sober up at that point. And uh, oh, so Dave, I'm a game geek. But well, very briefly, again, I think we saw him over at the arcade section. Well, overall, it was a very good day. I really enjoyed it. Um, like people said before, the game prices were a little bit high. They didn't really want to do deals, even though, you know, tried to get them down with the Super Mario Karts. Just weren't interested. So, I think I'm going to have to go back to eBay to pick up my first Japanese Sega Saturn game, because I haven't got one. In fact, I'm still waiting for the uh, Step Down Converter. I'll just show you the one I've got. I picked it up from eBay. Just a cheap one. I think it was like £10. And it's turned up and it's buzzing like mad. So I've sent it back and they're going to send me another one. So we'll see what that's like. I may get a, a proper one from Maplins. I know a few tubers have commented. You know, I don't want any fires going off up here. A bit loft. I've got one smoke alarm, but I might get another one. Try and uh, stick it behind the console cab. Yeah, green dog playing in the back. I could never get past that level in the day, but if you can see it. Yeah, horrible. So what I'll do now, I'll put a small montage of footage at the end of this video and um, unfortunately at the end of the, uh, the evening when we were on, on his way home in Paul's car we broke down we broke down just off of the woodhead at Junction 35A at McDonald's L luckily we linked it there his battery ran out of uh, electric so the alternator backed up so I eventually got home around midnight last night but um, didn't really matter because we had a great day anyway so I really enjoyed it um, and that's about it so onwards and upwards with the uh, montage I think that because uh, Sam's going to be asking for that my to get so there might be
Thanks.
indeed, yeah. It's been a great day so far. Uh, got some drinks there. I'm supping, supping. Waiting for me beer. That's it, that's what it's all about, isn't it? Yeah, yes. Just throw gaming and drinking. Indeed. How are you getting on anyway? I'm alright. You enjoyed it? I am enjoying it, yeah. I've had a couple of cans. <laughs> it's alright. You won't melt them. Okay, so we've just been at the bar with uh, Stu, 2 to UK. And we're feeling a little uh, tipsy, so to speak. Uh, Paul has got a... <laughs> 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 oh, that's horrible. Oh, you see me at the end? Oh, look at it! Look at it! Oh, <laughs> a very erect uh, hot dog. I've got some chips. A big dirty burger. Yes, that's right. A big dirty burger. Ghostbusters! <laughs> we had a pound for every time. That's it. We're a millionaire. We've done it. We've done it. We've done it. the objects of the games.
Backlit Game Boy. Hi guys, this is Matt Soul from Retro. We got Russ, Russ Newton, playing on the uh, Astro Cab, Astro City Cab. Rather sad ending to a very good day. <laughs> Been in McDonald's for some hours now. Finally going out. Thank you. 